Hello, um, this video explains the season for Cap Sim uh, Capstone 2018 Route 1 uh, winning guide and tips uh, update uh, in 2018, right? So first we can look at some uh, sample winning strategies. Uh, with this sample winning strategies, we have eight products in five segments. And you can see on the screen it's Route 8 and they are all selling very well. Uh, you see the uh, overview of marketing this season. Very good selling and good price. And also we see the good capacities in Route 8, uh, the selling uh, demand and also the production capacities of the product. You see that and also the automation update uh, bring the good result in Route 8. Uh, we get uh, very good uh, sales and net profit, the cash uh, so much that we can reduce uh, we can retire the stock of 37 million and also retire the long-term debt of 60 and still keep about 96 million cash in hand. So that's a very good result. And also you see the result from round uh, 4. The company get very good sales and net profit. Uh, you see, and through a it's very high sales uh, and high net profit uh, and business is all causing a good uh, stock price of 149. You see that, right? So that's overview of the result. Uh, to support uh, calculation, this simulation we get a lot of calculations. So we need uh, an Excel file that is provided, that's free to download from the internet. And you can see the links uh, at the end of this, uh, or you send the email to get the customized Excel file specified for your game for free. So follow the Excel file. You can this is a tool. It's not a cheating course or something. That's a tool to support you calculate more effectively. Okay, so we need Excel file to keep track of IND and marketing and pricing for all the eight rounds so that we can update uh, more precisely and faster, right? So for round number one, we start with the game. So that's good to start right from round number one because uh, if we make mistake, it needs uh, one or two rounds to fix the mistake, uh, especially in IND research and development. So round number one is the most important. Number two also important. So I give you two uh, I bring two uh, videos and also uh, the third for overview on the eight browser winning guide and tips so you can control the game, understand all the decisions and uh, apply your strategies, right? So first look at tip number one, tip number one, right? We um, create, uh, we can create a new low end sensors with performance and size of round four. It takes one year to uh, develop and then when the product ready, it is uh, optimal to sell. We don't have to update the low end product every round because this low end product needs about seven years round to seven year to, to sell most effectively. Um, again, again, it's very important to create an Excel file to keep track of all eight rounds IND based on industry condition report. You download the free Excel file and download the IND uh, industry condition report from your game and then you put only one round again, only one round into the Excel file. The file will automatically calculate the uh, ideal spot for all the eight rounds. So tip number one, create the low end sensors and uh, the new, you can uh, delay adding new uh, strategy to the second round because if you want to gain good sale and good net profit from the first round, you don't have to add right here because um, if you add new product right from round one, uh, higher cost and lower sales uh, will get good sales but no net, low net profit from round one. So um, my advice you can consider add new product right from the first round or the second round. Tip number two, change the MTBF to mostly optimal based on buying criteria. So we get uh, five product segments. You can check the career report to get the uh, mid time before failures to most optimal. Uh, if you want, you can increase that to max uh, of each segment, but that's in cost, uh, higher cost to produce. So the optimal is better uh, 14,000 for low end, 17,000 for traditional and 20,000 for, um, for size and 23,000 for high end and 27,000 for uh, performance. That's for MTBF. You can check the career report again. Uh, check buying criteria for each segment in the report to find what uh, criteria that customers prefer uh, better than the other factors. Right? And tip number three, you can apply strong promotion and sales budget for traditional and low end about 2000 and uh, other 1500. But actually, if you want to get good sale and good net profit, 
some good net profit right from round one and round two you can reduce that to 1500 for um, tradition and low end and the other about 1200 because uh, in the first few rounds the uh, net profit is a few millions only so you can save a few million costs that's good this is not good for not not necessary for the later round because when in later round you get dozens of million in net profit so spending a few million in uh, promotion and sale will not uh, reduce the net profit so not if you want to have some net profit from round one to three we can apply around 1500 or 1400 and then we increase us to uh, 1600 and 1800 uh, in next two rounds so that you can get both a good sale and also good net profit do not spend two thousand for all the five products uh, when the product reach 100 awareness 100 percent awareness and accessibility in round four or five you can reduce that back to a thousand four hundred uh, also you can take the strategy of competitors check their spending to decide uh, your spending just higher than competitors right so we move to tip number you can see the sample decision for our one but uh, do not use this number do not just use this number you need to modify a number by using your industry condition report and add that number into the excel file and then you get more precise number for your game for your specific game right now remember that we can add a new product in round one or round two depends on your strategy my suggestion you can consider that uh, right, right from round one is okay right you have long time to sell the new product one more round to sell the new product but when you do so the net profit for our one will be a little bit lower but you will get higher sale and higher net profit in later rounds so we get the tip of uh, launch a new product in june or july but sometime if you want to get the product close to the ideal spot it can be august or even september october but it's okay then later round you can sell better that depends on competitor strategy too and um, you keep track of customer buying criteria especially their price right for tip number four we set the price uh, as high as possible do not go to the price lower. some of the team they set the price very low and they can sell quite a lot but on the team get good a little bit good sales but very huge lots no one get profit because one or two team try to dump the price so we can in any case so try to set the price as high as possible so we get the net profit net profit is very important in this kind of game right um, only low end we have to keep the price lower than competitors because the price factor is uh, highly evaluated by customer in low end segment so when we compete uh, keep track of prices of competitors we do not go to price lower we need to maintain good sales and also more important maintain good net net profit and for tip number we can see the sample marketing here or come back to the beginning of this video to see the prices right Again, the price uh, we need to suggest that the price 29.5, 21 for low end, 29.5 for traditional. But depending on competitor, we can reduce the price and also uh, 39 for high end and 34.5 for both uh, performance and size. That's a very good price for. But uh, competitors can do the same, so you consider to lower and increase the price a little bit to get more competitive prices and get uh, good net profit. Do not dump the price because you can sell very well, but uh, you get no net no uh, net profit okay so the tip consider pricing strategy of competitors we keep track of the excel file each round we reduce about 50 cents to make our price more competitive and also we keep price too low close to competitor if they set a high price you can keep that higher a little bit but still lower than um, higher a little bit than the suggestion but still lower have to lower than competitor to set the price to keep the competitive at the price to set uh, so that the product can sell well and tip number five we update automation of low end to 6.7 and five that's examples only you can update to 6.5 or see even to seven depends on the uh, investment allowed for our one for our one the own company start from the equal point so you can set that to 6.5 or six depends and uh, low end need high automation that's the logical right we got low end product uh, automate uh, quite a lot can save the cost and traditional to five and then do not uh, we increase us to uh, 8 and 10 as far as possible in the two or three rounds three or four rounds for low end and traditional we increase that around eight and the other we can increase a little from around three or around four we can add more capacity for low end this is very important because if we add a new product we have the cost for andy 
and we need to add um, capacity for this product we can upgrade automation uh, later but uh, we can upgrade automation for low end drive from round one uh, the tip for this is can don't have enough uh, investment for update the product right from round one so we can consider sell some surplus capacity of uh, traditional and surplus capacity of high end so we get enough uh, investment right from round one this check is quite risky but you can consider that not to use the excel file is the number from your industry condition report again do not use a number suggested here check the number from your game industry condition report to get the number for your game to put that in the excel file if you cannot do that send the email i can create the excel file for free for you send the email to mba games 2002 at gmail.com i can create the excel file for you for free and send back in a few hours and you can see the sample production for numbers again for production we can add about five or ten percent depends on the situation uh, often you can add about ten percent higher than same focus so that you can avoid the stock out in case our product can sell well and very important in round one we add about 500 with automation of 50 for the new low-end product so next round when the product is ready we can have capacity to sell and this product add from round one and round two can sell very well and bring good sale and net profit in round three on round from three to eight with high growth rate of, uh, of this segment low end we can get very good sale so it's a trick to um, winning tip to add no end, low end product as new as as far as possible as early as possible right and tip number six the age of the product i am very important so we again we check the industry considered report uh, for each round to find Make sure we control the own the buying criteria for each segment. Uh, low end prefer the price, but the other maybe they prefer the edge, right? For low end, the edge uh, about seven is important. Five, six, seven sell very uh, well, better than one or two years old because low end need more stability of the product. And for traditional, eight number two, eight about two years old. <coughs> uh, for other as new as possible, right? So we check the price and age of each product in each segment. We can see that in the spend a few minutes to check the industry condition report um, tip number seven also this is very important we need to import up by IND every round so if you miss one round we cannot turn around the situation so it's very important to follow the schedule and update the product every round because uh, in fact we will forget to update the product for one round that's why round one is very important later round we cannot update the product to the ideal spot and then on the consequences very bad for the company if we do not update next round we cannot sell and we cannot get good net profit and we have very low investment so we don't have capacity in enough money to update the capacity increase capacity and update the product so the cost is higher than capital so this game is very important that we can we follow the game schedule update the product every round uh, okay Pricing is important, but less important than IND. IND is the most important decision in this game. So uh, we need to update the product as close to the ideal spot as possible. Good performance, good size can sell well, especially from round 4 or 5 to the end of the game. Uh, traditional IND update to the ideal spot too. High end, uh, we can update that as close to ideal spot as possible. If we cannot, because that takes longer time and higher cost, so you can uh, update about 30%. And performance so we can update easily to idea spot for size we update as close to the idea spot as possible round one two three take longer time to update but from round four five to the end of the game it is quite easy to update the product so keep track of all this step this is very important again okay? ind the most important decision for to win this game and um, uh, round one results often we get we sell 150 million and net profit only five so again uh, do not focus too much on net profit but keep that uh, positive so we can uh, get good investment for later round for next round so we need to get a few million net profit for round one round two round three only a few that's just enough but keep that positive and avoid the emergency loan uh, also the sale is very high but uh, again because in the first three rounds we focus on new R&D new product development promotion and sales so we cannot get um, uh, effective enough uh, and also we increase automation of the factory from round 4 and 5 we can get very good sales and we can lead the game in round 6, 7, 8 with both uh, high sale and high net profit right so again the most important thing in this round 1 is uh, in round 1 is to add new product which will sell better 
so we add uh, one or two or three new products in round one to three depends on our strategy but we need to add at least one or two new products uh, also we need to need add new capacity the same round so that next round when the product is ready we have capacity to produce if you want to some net profit right from round one we do not add uh, too much capacity um, because uh, we get limited investment so for round one net profit is around one or two or three million or five million is just good enough uh, we will get uh, a dozen of million net profit from round four maybe hundred as you can see at the beginning of this video we get 98 or 150 uh, million cash in hand huh? tip number eight also this is also important we add capacity for the new product again i said before right we need to add new product also add new capacity so we can when the product is ready after ind developed we can get uh, capacity to produce automation for the new product about five automation for the old uh, low end product about six or seven or six by five or six by seven depends right automation for the others we increase by one point uh, we leave high-end performance inside to increase automation in round two round three round four when we get a better or higher investment budget right so do not use max investment use about 80 percent sometimes you can use 90 percent um, it's good enough uh, especially competition because we need to keep, keep some cash in hand avoid the stock out Apply uh, the hour of cash or we need emergency loan, we lose the point of uh, competition. Tip number nine, uh, for finance, uh, round one, we need to get max uh, investment, long-term investment about 13 million and get max stock issue about 18 million. So we get about 30 million of investment for round 131 million. We need to check cash available about 5 to 10 million to avoid the uh, emergency loan. But we don't know what the strategy of competitors uh, so let's keep the the strategy we feel safe for our one round two round three we can find and see the strategy of competitor from round two so we can get better a more competitive strategy so do not invest too strong right from round one just keep good sale good net profit and most important for our one we need to add uh, a new product and capacity so we get tuned to competitive we go ahead to one round compare with competitors Tip number 10 to use about 80% on investment, maybe 90% is okay. And very important, we add uh, about 500 or 400 capacity for um, new product, low end product in this case. If we use about 80%, we spend a little bit less and we can get good net profit. And also good sales from round one. And net later round, we can get round two, we can get more investment. So, um, for the winning kind tip of round one, uh, with this kind tip, you can start round one uh, with good uh, and right decision. So, we don't have any error to fix uh, from later round. We just keep going, add more product, increase capacity, increase automation, set a good price, a good uh, budget for promotion and sale. And then we can increase the sale very fast and get good net profit right from round three, four, and little game from round six, seven, and eight. So again, keep track of time new products are launched. Try to launch new products in June or July. Sometimes that can be August or October. It's okay, right? Uh, this strategy will have some net profit um, from one to three or five, around five millions from round one to round two, round three. And from round four and five, we can get very good sale and net profit. And from round six, seven, eight, we can get the highest uh, sale and net profit. It is very important to keep good sales and positive net profit right from round one. So next round, we will have good investment for new capacity for higher automation. So we can save better cost and then we can get higher margin. So we can bring the good net profit. So net profit is quite important right from round one. But don't expect to harm too much. That's a positive net profit is okay. So that's for reference. This game is very interesting because uh, the, uh, the product here is a sensor. So we can see many many application of sensor in every aspect of life and industry so good luck and success if you need any personal support for our one and our tools that is free you can send the an email and you can download the excel file and start your game again good luck and success enjoy your game